Augustus Caesar was one of the most famous and influential rulers in history. But his journey to becoming the first emperor of Rome was far from ordinary. Augustus was born Gaius Octavius, into a relatively obscure family. But when his great-uncle, Julius Caesar, was assassinated, Octavius was suddenly thrust into the spotlight. Octavius was only 18 years old at the time, but he quickly proved to be a shrewd and ambitious politician. He formed an alliance with two other powerful men, Mark Antony and Lepidus, and together they formed a triumvirate, or three-man rule, over Rome. Over the next few years, Octavius and his allies eliminated their rivals and consolidated their power. In 31 BC, Octavius defeated Antony at the Battle of Actium, making him the sole ruler of Rome. Over the next few years, Octavius and his allies eliminated their rivals and consolidated their power. In 31 BC, Octavius defeated Antony at the Battle of Actium, making him the sole ruler of Rome. Octavius was now the most powerful man in the world. But he knew that he needed to be careful. The Roman people were still suspicious of absolute power, and they had a history of overthrowing tyrants. So Octavius cunningly disguised his autocratic rule by pretending to restore the Roman Republic. He created a new senate and a new system of government, but he made sure that he was always in control. Octavius also made a number of reforms that improved the lives of the Roman people. He built new roads and bridges, expanded the empire, and promoted peace and prosperity. As a result of his reforms, Octavius became immensely popular. The Roman people loved him, and they gave him the title of Augustus, which means, revered one. Augustus Caesar ruled Rome for over 40 years. During his reign, he transformed the Roman Republic into the Roman Empire. 